My name is Jim Houts. I'm with Molecular Imaging Products in Bend, Oregon. I'd like to address an issue that we see frequently out in the field with respect to the activated charcoal filters. This is the proper position of the activated charcoal filter with the conduit attached to the pressure relief valve on the rebreathing head or non-rebreathing system. Going into the activated charcoal filter in the upright position, you can see the holes at the bottom of this. What we don't want to see is the activated charcoal filter placed in a position like this or have it on its side. And the reason is, if it's placed like this, there's really no way for the gases to escape through the activated charcoal canister. And if we put it on its side, there, the activated charcoal in this canister acts like a liquid and it will seek its level and there will be a slight area above that activated charcoal that doesn't have any charcoal in it and these gases will follow the path of least resistance and they may pass just across the top of the activated charcoal and not go through the core of it. For sure what we really don't want to see is the activated charcoal filter taped to the post of the anesthesia device. The reason is that discourages the weighing of the activated charcoal can canister, and these are to be weighed when you receive them, record that weight, and then periodically re-weigh them, and when they have gained 50 grams of anesthetic, they're to be discarded and replaced.